<laughs> well, Jungle Beats, Australia's plug to the laughest, laughest reviews in the country. My name is Saxophone Susan. <laughs> I'm Alexander Sandalas, aka Sandy Sand, your mama's mom. And we're here today. <laughs> I don't know what we're here to do today, but we're here to do today to do today, King James. Motherfucking Anderson Park. Oh, and before we get into this bitch, did you know that he has stated, or oh, I don't know if it's true, but someone told me that he had stated that in an interview that Oxnard, he said was more of a Dr. Dre album than an Anderson Park album, which is why it might have felt a little unfamiliar compared to his past work. Interesting. That makes sense because Dr. Dre had a big hand in that. Mm -hmm. He produced the whole thing. He, he oh no, produced a large it part of it. Produced it he had mastered it, I'm pretty sure. So, um, so he said, like, he still loves the album. We said maybe it wasn't received as well. Maybe you weren't feeling me as much because I didn't have a hundred percent creative direction with that album. He said I'm that was more a Dre product That's than a Park product. We said, but this new shit coming out, pure Park. And he's quick after it, right? This is only less than less Bruh, than three months. So quick on it, and we're, we're well, about three months, and we're here, so, King uh, James. I'm expecting either something a bit more real or something like the. I don't know if we'll get something like uh, No Warriors, but... With a title track like King James, I'm expecting something hard. You reckon? King, King James, like what does King James represent? One yeah. of the best basketball players on the planet. How do you know what I meant? It could be King James, like the one of the kings of uh, the UK. Like Europe, back hundreds of years ago. Yeah. Fuck, maybe. I'm just not feeling like that's probably... You think LeBron James is really king? Is that his nickname? It's his nickname, man. Oh, Are you shit. serious? Are you fucking yeah, with me? Yeah, man, I'm serious. I didn't know that. Yeah, that's his nickname. I King James. I just always called him LeBron the King. Okay. Okay. We well, you know what direction this is going in. <laughs> this is this porno direction. <laughs> wow. Is that our theme for today? Porn? Big old slums? So far. Whistle though. That's a nice flavor. I can just feel Terry Crews in the background is blowing it, just dancing. Like on White Chicks. Yeah, that's the best. That's my favorite scene. <laughs> So fucking good. His pecs are jiggling. <laughs> this honestly doesn't feel like very strong on its own, but within the concept or within an album, I think I can see this being stronger. Absolutely. It kind of just feels like a not necessarily an anthem, but like it's very it's very hooky. Like dun dun, come on with me. Dun 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 dun. dun. Like it's just, he is. In the verses, he is. Uh, oh yeah, he was speaking socially and politically conscious. Mm -hmm. It's it's a really pleasing, jazz soul, flavored Anderson Park track. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I can say you could put this on Malibu. You could fit right on. Right. In a sense. And I, I kind of get now. It's, it's it's not so much King James. It's not really about his the physical presence and him his, his dominance it's more about the message that he uh represents and kind of the things that he's doing in his community to inspire people that's the message i got from that track mm -hmm. um who he is rather than what he looks like uh and anderson is carrying that message on hmm. i like that um but, but that's it really it's just a, it's just a pleasant track yeah. i don't really have much more to say on it like i'd go back to and listen to it if it came on but like it's not it's not anything amazing to me. But the saxophone for performance was was very pleasant and was very Thank soothing. I'm saxophone about. Susan. Thank you. Oh, the, oh, Thank oh, you. oh, that was me, man. Shit, saxy. Man, Susan, Susan. I'm gonna take off all my clothes in the next video. 
And you're going to be like, whoa. I won't be here. You're going to be like, whoa. Man, it's dick. It's fire. Let us know what you guys thought of this uh, track below and what you're expecting of Anderson Puck this year. Mm -hmm. Make sure to uh, subscribe if you want. Yeah, because you know, the, we, we liked Oxnard, but we didn't like it enough to put in our top tens. Oh, we, yeah. If you want to go, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah? yeah. 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 If you, we reviewed it, so if yeah. you want to go watch that, go ahead and watch that. Yeah. It'll be in the corner. Yeah. 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 But uh, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah. yeah. Come for me. Dancing, going with me. This is a pretty track. Also, 